la 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 Leo, la 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 Leo, la 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 Leo, la 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 Leo, la la la. What's up, Leo? What's up, Lion? Gang? What's up, baby? Don't mind this. I'm on Pebble Patrol. Okay, I knew something dysfunctional was going to happen. Uh, what's going on, Leo? It's between the 1st and the 15th of September for a lion. What's popping? What's going on with y'all? Are y'all behaving y'all selves? Your birthday season just left. Y'all cut up a little bit or a lot of it? <laughs> this is your first time doing my channel. Hey, boo, hey. I'm Mocha. Welcome to the Mocha Love Tarot channel. I may cuss a little bit. I may cuss a lot. Just depending on what the hell these cards say. Y'all know the drift, okay? For all of my new subscribers, welcome to the family. We're a little dysfunctional, but we received you, baby, okay? Because let me tell you something. We don't fight. We don't fuss. We do cuss. We share. We enlighten. We uplift. We evolve. We grow, okay? So the only thing we're doing over here is win, 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 winning. That negative shit, keep it over there on the Mother People channel. We don't want it over here, okay? We've been real smooth. I've been here for seven months, and I can count on my hands and still have fingers left how many incidents I've had with people getting blatantly disrespectful in the comments. So I'm thankful for that because not many people can say that, all right? Um, also, um, the $10 reading, the one question, one card, one question, one card. I put one card, okay? I'm just giving you an example. Maybe one card, okay? With that one card, I'm going to clarify that one card during this reading with three cards, okay? So it'll look like this to answer your one question, okay? That reading is 10 minutes and it's $10. It's going to end August the 31st forever and always, okay? So if you do want that $10 reading, please get it in because it's getting ready to go bye-bye forever. After the 31st, after September, when y'all hit me like, Mocha, I want the $10, I'll be like, what, what? I don't have one of them. So make sure you look in the description box, okay, for pricing and stuff, as well as the donations and things. Also, y'all, thank you for the donations. Thank y'all for everything that y'all have been doing. Thank you for the love, the shares, the comments, the likes. I appreciate all of that. Y'all show me so much love. Y'all receive me, so I receive you back with a hundredfold. You understand? Ain't nothing but love over here. Love and genuineness. I can't be nobody else but myself. All right, so for those folks like, you crazy, I be that, whatever, okay, your mother, whatever, all right, because don't get it twisted. Mocha is very centered, all right, I definitely embrace all this light, but I had to get to, get to know some darkness to get to this point, okay, so don't try me, all right, because I keep it centered, I keep it funky, and I'm quite, I, I'm just the same human flesh that you are, this is a flesh suit, so I cut your ass out and ask God for forgiveness and keep it moving, so don't do that, all right, um, Let's get it. Uh, this will be from the 1st to the 15th of September for my Leos, okay? Um, this is not a personal. If you need a personal, hit me up. This is a general, so it may or may not apply. Make sure you check all of your signs, okay, babies? All right. So the first message comes from, um, right, and again, this is for my sun, moon, rising, Venus, as well as the cross watchers for la, 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 Leo. All right. Let's get it. The first message that I have for you guys, y'all, that literally jumped off and said, they wanted to speak, okay, comes from the Crystal Angels Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue, and it's Emerald. This is pretty. Emerald. Ceremonies and celebrations. It's a time of important life passages, such as weddings, birthdays, graduations, or anniversaries, okay? So I feel like y'all birthday season about some interesting characters and things to the surface, all right? There will be a reason to gather with loved ones and celebrate together. This card is a sign of an important human ritual to signify a passage such as a wedding, birth, or graduation. You may be called into leadership for this event, including being a planner or officiant. This card may be a sign, I'm sorry, may, may be a sign of taking a love relationship to the next level and celebrating your union. If you are currently single, this can be a positive sign of meeting your long-term partner, okay? Hey. Ultimately, you are conduit to bring the divine energy to earth and have the ability to celebrate all life for the upliftment and healing of others. I tell y'all all the time, Leo is fixed, just like Taurus, Scorpio and Aquarius, y'all bring the beauty, the substance to things, things that are dead, people, spirits, energy that is dead, you bring, you come around and boom, you bring the substance to things, so never take that from yourself and never, ever, 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 ever let nobody put your fire out. Because that's what makes you glow. That's what makes you beautiful. 
That's what makes you authentically you. Okay. So this is what I have from the 1st to the 15th of uh, September. Mother Gaia wanted to speak to y'all, baby. Y'all have choices, decisions to make, Leo, during this time. You have to make a decision, okay? So you, for those of you who are indecisive, you got to get out of this. I see now the people who, watch who you tell your business to, because the people who are, some of y'all, the people who are sending you light and uplifting you and all this shit during this time, you're going to find out that they snakes. All right? You see that snake holding that light? Yeah, you here for me or whatever, but let me find out you you you, you crushing on the first the same person I'm talking. You 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 shining him down, okay? You 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 knocking him off off my pedestal so he can stand on your look so he can stand on your ladder, okay? Also, I do see um some of y'all you have to get over situations that you've been resentful over in the past, Leo. I feel like. There was, there's this door, one door, this door here, you see how this lady here is just crying and she's overwhelmed, she's so emotional. I feel like, Leo, you're moving out of this place, you've come out of this place, okay? You've, you're done with that part. You Now you're in a state of going through this blind faith, having blind faith to start over, okay? Because I feel like you're having to make a decision. Ultimately, you're having to start over completely, but the choice is yours, your free will choice will be respected, okay? And, but however, you see this door here? This door here, it's an unknowing door. There's nothing attached to it, okay? However, you see that snake up there? He, you see what path he trying? He trying to light the light on this narrow path because his ass can't get that far. You understand? You can't get that far. I'm leave, on this door. Behind this door, you leave the snakes behind, baby. But you learn. You take the enlightenment. You see this apple? I always signify the apple as a teacher's pet, all right? You see this apple? This apple... With this enlightenment that you've that you've taken, this enlightenment, this wisdom that you've attained, you're gonna take it through this damn door where the path is real thin, and you can't take everybody with you, baby. And you're gonna go and you're gonna grow to the going into the unknown on your journey. But it's it's one that has built you, built you because you've been here. You've been in this sad and remorseful place. You've been in this place of not really speaking your feelings. See, the sword signifies communication. The sword is down. So you've been in this place of Allowing people to literally lead you, lead you down a path where you don't want to go. However, your love for them, you get what I'm saying? This could also be an air sign. The your love for them kept you in a space of not speaking up for yourself and not saying shit that you know is right. But it kept you blinded and not wanting to see things. You can go back down that path because I feel like these people are coming to the surface during this time. I feel air. I feel water is coming. OK, and this one here is something completely new, but you're so scared of it because of these two motherfuckers. You got to let it go. Make a choice. If you're going to start over, do it the right way. Some of y'all during this time are having to balance out, are, about, are going through balancing your masculine and your feminine. A lot of y'all are going to be dealing with your twin flame during this time, the 1st to the 15th. Leo, y'all third eye is on fire. Trust your intuition. If you felt it, you felt it for a reason. If you if you dreamt it, you dreamt it for a reason. Trust your dreams, trust your premonitions, trust your downloads, and don't allow them to put you in an anxious, scary place. Do not ain't let them to fear, but fear itself. Let that shit go. Scared for what? All right. You made it through the rest of this bullshit. Why wouldn't you make it through a situation that's meant to better you? You may have to let some things and people go, but it's side and iris. It's time to hit the door because I got places to be. I gotta win. All right. So some of y'all, I'm also seeing during this time. Ooh, during this time, you may have a mother figure, and I strongly feel like a mother figure is some type of mother. It could be a big sister, a mother, the mother of your children. This person, they, I feel like when they communicate with you, this person really doesn't take your opinions or take your feelings into consideration before they communicate. This is somebody who is highly intuitive that you're going to be dealing with, okay? This person kind of makes you question your integrity based on your decisions that you've made in the past. Do not allow, allow this person to uh, do that because I do see here your integrity is what makes you beautiful and the experiences and the things that you've went through in the past it taught you how to look out for the snakes baby it taught you how to see them and keep the grass low it brought you wisdom it taught you how to fucking watch out for the fast talker for the fast moving for the finesse it taught you to be great you know how to recognize and see it and see the deceiver from a mile away when they coming okay but don't think that everybody is out to get you or try to deceive you because that's a fear paradigm that you'll put yourself in and it's really hard to get out of it and let that go because it's hard for you to walk in situations with optimism when you do that all right but i do see a mother figure okay this mother could also be um she could be a tourist this is an earthy 
Tell you, this mother could be somebody. Somebody, mama is a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. She's an Earth sign. She's very grounded. Okay, this person tries to tell you. This could also be an Air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But this person talks to you, and when they talk to you, you may feel like, damn, watch how you handling me. But this person does mean well. They love you. They they want the best for you. However, they may feel, and also this person here, they can't speak too much because they got some skeletons in their own damn closet. The things shook out. And to be honest, a lot of y'all are breaking cycles during this time. So trust what you feel. Trust your inner knowing and trust your own decision. You can take into consideration what other people got to say, but that don't mean you got to move like what the hell they talk about, okay? Because I do see some of y'all are having communication issues with your mother. You having a you having a hard time balancing your negative, your, 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 I'm sorry, your, fam, your masculine and your feminine within yourself when you're dealing with people as far as communication because, Leo, you're walking back into your fight. I mean, you're walking back into your, you walk, just, I said it right, you're walking back into your fight. You're walking back into your power, okay? You're feeling enlightened. A lot of y'all, y'all, again, I cannot stress, your third eye will be booming. A lot of y'all have newness written all around your future, but you got to let some things go, baby, all right? Some of y'all got an air sign coming in. This will be a male, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Some of y'all are kind of indecisive during this time. You have, you need to make a decision whether you're going to continue and continue on um, moving forward on your path in love or dealing with somebody who, who you were just possibly having sex with. I feel like y'all are looking towards a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Y'all love this person. This person loves you. Strong emphasis on Cancer, but it could also be this Pisces. This person loves you. I feel like you and this person may have had a passionate connection. Maybe y'all were just having sex, but sex actually grew the feelings. Y'all got to learn a lot about each other in the midst of y'all being sexual, okay? Y'all conversations came about. Y'all learned things about one another. And I feel like this is somebody who initially the agreement was we was going we gonna hit it and quit it we gonna bust it down we gonna bust it down we gonna bust it down and they want to stay around and you ain't know how to you ain't know how to see that or maybe this was you and they ain't know how to respond to it even though both parties mutually love each other i am seeing also some of y'all some of y'all could also be indecisive about what to do with the toy some of y'all some of y'all are going to be getting proposals during this time like somebody's gonna ask you to put a ring on it, leo and somebody's gonna be indecisive like i don't know because they want to stick to their wild path does that path okay is that wild path is it going to bring you integrity does that respect your integrity is it something that does, does it represent your integ integrity in a positive light because your integrity is what makes you attractive to people the love that the care that you put within yourself okay Spirit, please show me the messages for Leo between the first and the fifteenth of September. Yes, some of y'all, some of y'all are indecisive. Okay, some of y'all also got an air sign in your energy. This could be somebody who you're married to, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This person don't know what the hell they want. I feel like there is love there, but this person is very indecisive. They want to be able to have the 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 right to go screw who they want to, but they want you to be upright. That's not right. I also see that this person could also you could find out that this person could be having sex with a, with a Taurus. This Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, the Pisces, uh, Cancer, Scorpio energy. You and this person, this person is both y'all in love with y'all or with each other, but both of y'all have the energy of doing what y'all want to do. Some of y'all got an air sign stalking you, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, I feel like if you're going to court during this time, you are going to be victorious in anything having to do with legal matters. I feel like for those of you going to court for child support or you finally making the decision to put child support on somebody that you're separated from, you're going to finally make the decision and you're going to be victorious in doing so because you try to be fair with this person, but possibly in use uh, during this time. Some of y'all could be looking at somebody's social media and seeing, damn, you buying big bottles, you're doing all of this, but you're not doing shit by our kids. Yeah, I, I, I'm the understanding is done. Now I can logically see that you ain't right. You don't you don't want to do right. So I'm not gonna sit up here and keep taking these L's because you don't want to do right. You chose that path, not me. I didn't make a baby by myself. Okay, I do see y'all telling somebody that. Some of y'all, some of y'all need to trust y'all intuition when it comes to somebody having a child because y'all, somebody definitely have a somebody got a kid coming. This could be an Aquarius with this number two here because I do see here, y'all, y'all could be dealing with an Aquarius. Some of y'all could be dealing with a water sign that got a hidden child, okay? And I feel like they have been juggling you and possibly another earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, okay? They're trying to keep everything cool, like the waters is all smooth and shit, but she's starting to get a little rocky back there, okay? She's starting to get a little unsmooth, and it's hard to, you can't keep, you can't, this person can't, it's not going to be able to keep juggling this shit and keeping as if everything is okay. They're going to lose, they're going to they lose this try real soon. 
that shit's coming to the forefront. Trust your knowing though, because I feel like some of y'all have already dreamt this. And I'm I'm feeling like it's something that keeps coming to you synchronistically. Even with me saying it to y'all. I ain't the first person that said it on here. Um, yeah, some of y'all need to trust y'all intuition about a three-party situation, okay? Having to do with yourself, okay? Could also be an airy. Some of y'all, some of y'all got some of y'all issues going on with um with an Aries, okay? And I feel like y'all want to reunite. I don't feel like this is love. It can be love, but I feel like this is more of a friendship, okay? Maybe there was a three-party situation between... It could have been something as you and your friend fell out behind it being fear of a three-party situation. Because I feel like you walked away from somebody because... This could be a strong friendship, though, with these two women here, these two friends. I do feel like, and usually I would say, yeah, reunited, but I feel like this is two friends reuniting, okay? This could be some of y'all had to walk away from someone, or some of y'all possibly had a friend. You're going to find out that you had a friend walk away from you, okay? This person could have been in fear that she was pregnant by somebody who you dealt with in the past, or vice versa. This could have been you doing this to another person, okay? But I do see once the situation gets resurrected, okay? Some of y'all going to find out you was in a third party situation, possibly with a Taurus or a Libra or a Scorpio, okay? But there is definitely a baby involved. And some of y'all are ready to reunite with somebody and it's not happening in the pace that you wanted to because this person is internally fighting themselves because they know that the change is coming and it's coming really swift and it's out of their control. Y'all dealing with somebody who don't want to face it, who don't want to sing the song and the tune of the karma, the karma that they made. They made this bed. They don't want to lay in it. Okay, you're going to find that out too. Fear, why is the two of swords here for my Leos? What's going on with my babies? What's going on? Y'all be getting mad when I be running these. I be wanting to fight these people for y'all. <laughs> oh, Lord. Yeah, some of y'all are going to possibly receive communication from a fire sign. Uh, Aries, Leo, Sag. I feel like the communication is going to bring change. Okay, I feel like... For some of y'all, you love this person, but this person is going to communicate with you that, hey, um, you know, hey, I can't give you what it is that you want me to give you. You want reciprocity. I just want to bust something down right now. I like to be free, and y'all going to release this person, okay? Um, some of y'all also are going to get uh, y'all dealing with an air sign that's indecisive in y'all energy. You could you could be married to this person, or been with this person for a very long time, but there's a change dynamic coming to you because something having to do with a water sign as well as children. Okay, I feel like it's synchronistic, and I feel like you better trust your dreams because. They are trying to tell you something, okay? Why is the hierophant here? Yeah, the hierophant is here. Some of y'all are, again, some of y'all are going to be receiving proposals. I hope I didn't fuck it up, okay? But if I did, congratulations. It's still X Prize, okay? But I do see um, some of y'all are going to be starting something new with the tourists, okay? Some of y'all are going to be starting new jobs during this time. I feel like for those of you who've been trying to have businesses, who you've been trying to see them balance out, you've been trying to actually... Um, See more money that you see more money that you're saving than what you're spending having to do with your business. It's kind of making you defensive towards going out and doing things. That's going to change. Your business is going to pick up, baby. Okay, work is going to pick up. Some of y'all got new job opportunities coming and going to fall in your lap. And for some of y'all, this shit that y'all applied for last year, I'm hearing. Yeah, some of y'all, some of y'all want to move forward with a fire sign, okay? Um, but it's just entirely too burdensome. Some of y'all have an earth sign in y'all energy. This person, this person, there is a, there, I feel it's the same thing with that fire energy. It's like, you want a reciprocity from me, but I feel like this is external to you, Leo. This person wants give and take with you, but you just want to like, like you was just a smash and dash. Like, why, why are you even acting like this? That's how you looking at, some of y'all looking at this earth energy. Some of y'all have a soulmate spine on y'all, Leo. Some of y'all could be spine on the water sign. Okay, because I feel like intuitively you you know that they're connected to some type of family dynamic, okay? And I feel like you're gonna see that this is why this person can't give to you what you what you want what you want from them. Some of y'all are indecisive, okay, when it comes to an earth sign, okay? Or for some of y'all it's a Scorpio. Some of y'all are indecisive with about a Scorpio, okay? Some of y'all are gonna be walking away from a Scorpio, but there's not an equal level give equal level of give and take, okay? So you're gonna be walking away from this situation and transforming and doing something different. Because I feel like you've been in a period of indecision like this person makes you feel like you're not good enough or what you're doing is not good enough and you need to balance the scales out for some of y'all it's illegal doing this to y'all um yeah some of y'all you need to trust your intuition if you're dealing with a fire sign they've been very defensive towards you it's because they hide some shit 
they hiding some shit. The seven of swords fell on to it. The, the two of pentacles. What they're hiding is the fact that I'm juggling you and somebody else. And this shit getting tiring. Shit, I'm finna, I'm finna trip and fall real soon. And you're going to be able to see all this bullshit come tumbling out my hands. All these swords of shit that I wasn't telling you about. And you're going to move on from me. And they that's the last thing this person wants. They definitely love cake. Okay? Some of y'all are going to find out again using a three-party situation. And a child was made. A child was conceived. Okay? From, from the situation. And it's going to break your heart. And it definitely has to do with the earth sign. Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. For some of y'all, you've been waiting on the Aries to make an offer to you or a Sagittarius or another Leo. This person is, I feel like their offer is coming, but it's slow moving because I feel like they're fixing things having to do with their own family situations as well. Some of y'all are moving away from someone that you have children with or possibly moving away from an air sign, okay? Um, some of y'all also, if you're dealing with an air sign, Gemini Libra Queers, they could possibly be leaving you for a new mother of their child. Um, sorry, sis, but I, I got to read it how I see it. Somebody could be leaving you for a new mother of their child. Okay, and I feel like this needed to happen because you needed to walk away. The universe has literally been trying to pull you from this toxicity of this person, but you chose not to leave Leo, and they're going to make you, they're going to make you hit the dough. Some of y'all are literally going to fall out with another person, okay, behind something having to do with the child. All right. The child could actually be a, a water sign child as well. This could also, this child could also have something to do with a Pisces as well, or a Scorpio. But yeah, some of y'all, <laughs> some of y'all are going to be reuniting with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I do see strong Taurus vibes. Possibly, you're gonna reunite with this person. This person is gonna try to bring you in with money and financial financial offers to you okay but i feel like some of y'all are going to be very cutting toward this person because you feel like you don't have enough of shit i'm tired of this shit it's the same shit the same roller coaster ride i want newness so if i got to uh, to create this newness a lot of y'all are going to move forward by your damn self go focus on your coins and these pretty ass birds out here and go fucking and go get your own newness you're going to go i'm, I'm going to move like this okay and in doing so in doing so i'm looking at my new beginning i'm looking at my new passions I'm looking at my coin growing, okay? A lot of y'all want this. A lot of y'all want this Ten of Cups right here. Sorry. Y'all got the Ten of Pentacles out here too. Bam. A lot of y'all want this Ten of Pentacles, okay? This family situation, this family dynamic with someone, which is why it's going to hurt so bad. But again, it's how you look at it. Shift your perspective. It's not what's happening to you, but for you. Go get your, go get your own. Go get Go get, go get, go get your blessing. Go get it, okay? Some of y'all going to have to go get it because you want this Ten of Pentacles, but you putting, what you don't understand is this, this slow moving offer that you like, mm, this Aries, for some of y'all it's an Aries, Leo, or Sag. Some of y'all it's another Taurus or Capricorn, Virgo. This slow moving offer, okay? With this slow moving offer, yeah, I want it. You see how this man, this lady got her own bread right. Yeah, he coming in. I got this. I'm holding this pinnacle, you know, but I have the potential to be a king one day. So I'm moving slow to get my pinnacles right so I can come to with you with more pinnacles. But in the meantime, you already got nine. If I add my one to you, then this is what we come out with. If only you let me in because this is the same 10. If only you let me in. But you're going to let me in because things are happening around you. <laughs> things are happening. Change is coming to your dynamic. Change is coming to my dynamic. Okay, I'm, I'm cutting shit out. You cutting shit out. So be, you may not let me. You may not see you letting me in now, but you are gonna let me in because I'm not gonna stop. I'm moving slow, but that don't mean I ain't persistent. But this is what you got coming to you. Newness all around. New coins, new jobs. Okay, new creative endeavors, new businesses, new, new, new. You know why? You had to go through that bullshit to know how to recognize the deceiver. When the deceiver shows their face, you know how to see their ass from a hundred yards away. Do you understand? So you can run like hell. Because I've been there, done that, wrote the damn book, got the damn t-shirt, and I'm over your ass. All right? But I do see, for some of y'all, you're going to be restoring your marriages during this time. For those of you who are already married, you're going to fix your marriage. But only if you let this, and I feel like this is the earth sign. You let this person know I ain't with the shits from you. I can go and create all of this shit that you promised to me by myself. By myself. Because I am a motherfucking lion. You want to hear me roar or not? Okay? You end the cycles to go into a new one. One where you value 
respect, adore, cherish the beauty that you bring to people, places, and things. Okay? I love y'all, my babies. This is what I have for the 1st to the 15th of September in them cycles. In them cycles for people who cannot appreciate the beauty of Leo. As above, so below. Y'all are the energy that sits between, pretty much kind of in the mid heavens, between here on earth with the through with the surface with us, as well as as heaven, as you know what I'm saying, as heaven as it is on as heaven as it is on earth. They were speaking about a motherfucking Leo, a motherfucking Taurus, a motherfucking Aquarius, and a Scorpio. But the change starts with you. You have to stand up. For what you were authentically put here for as a purpose. for you, I'm sorry, as your purpose in order for you to get it, baby. You got to get it because once you get it here, this here is going to let you know how, what to do here. And you open this up to receive everything God has for you. It starts with you, boo. What you going to do? I love y'all. Hit me up for that personal because some of y'all finna need me. Love y'all, boo. <laughs>